this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. And, uh, excuse me, <laughs> and another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. Good morning, William Beaver. Good morning, Folly Raider. And good morning, Fizzy Elephant. Really? You took that as your opportunity to stand in my doorway. How long have I been doing my intro the same for? And you completely threw <laughs> me off there. <laughs> anyway, good morning, everyone. Today's an exciting day because today uh, we're going to head to the, the art gallery that we've been building recently. And we're all going to be putting on our very own exhibits. But before we even think about doing that, we are going to have our breakfast. Well, at least I'm going to have my breakfast. You guys can all sort yourselves out and eat what you want. I am going to have my cake. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious, Barnaby. Uh, you can stand up and you can follow me. And before uh, we go and head over to the, the the smart art art gallery, which is a difficult thing to, to say. F Fizzy, every time I walk through a door, is there going to be an elephant standing there throughout this episode? Oh, you're going to make that your mission now, aren't you? <laughs> well, Fizzy, I'm going to use this door. <laughs> Sneaky side door. <laughs> right then, today to the love garden, I am going to be adding Benji. And the reason I'm adding Benji is because he made this enormous wooden model of me. And you can see how big it is there by comparing it to his uh, his hand. And you can see he made a cake and there's a tiny little chicken on my shoulder as well. And a bunch of other animals as well. And I thought it was really cool. I want to say thank you so much for making it and sending me the picture. And welcome to my love garden. And you know what? Seeing as I'm adding uh, Benji to the, the love garden, I think it's only right that I go and be joined by Benji the dog as well. So I'm going to have a Benji in the love garden. And then I'm going to have a, a Benji uh, joining me throughout the, the episode in dog form as well. So the plan of the day is, is that there's... There's five rooms inside of the, the art gallery. Uh, one for me. Uh, we got Polly, William and Fizzy. And then uh, my Luna friends as well should hopefully uh, be joining us a little bit later on. And then they're going to go and do their exhibit. I have no idea what everyone else is going to build. They don't know what I'm going to, to build. So at the end of the episode, we can kind of just go and show off what we, uh, we built and uh, show our art exhibit. So that's going to be jolly good fun. But where's Benji? Here he is. Benji, you can stand up and uh, you can join me. And uh, yeah, we're going to show you where the... Um, the, the art gallery is. We actually got the, the actual building done really fast. You haven't seen it yet. It's the, um, the, the building with the, the cool reflective floor that you're going to, to see soon. Basically, there's a, a little trick you can kind of do with ice to, to make the, the floor look all shiny. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be uh, pretty cool. And then um, it's going to be a bit weird what I'm building because I'm not really... I'm kind of... This is like going to be the only episode I think where I'm building where I'm only going to be really placing one block. And <laughs> that might not make much sense to you now why I'm only placing one block, but it will do a little bit later on uh, when you see what my idea is. But here we go. This is where the, the, the smart art gallery is. And uh, we all got our different rooms here that we can go and build uh, our different exhibits in. And oh, wait a minute. There's a sign here. Home by Luna Friends. Have the Luna Friends built theirs already? I think they're, oh, they're in here. The Luna Friends are already in here. Hello, guys. <laughs> I didn't think that you'd have built it already. They must have got up really early and started building. We stayed up and built all night to get it finished. Okay, well, that's fantastic. Well, let, let me go and check out what you built right now then, seeing as it's uh, already... No, 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 I won't. I'm going to wait. I'm going to shut the door and I'm going to wait so I can go and uh, see everyone's at the, the same time. So I think that's going to be the, the best way to do it. So, uh, yeah, thanks for, for building that for me. And uh, I'll go and check it out a little bit later on. So I'll see you later, guys. Bye. <laughs> right then, I did not expect that. So, uh, yeah, as I said, we all have our, our different rooms where we're going to, to build. Uh, but we're not going to, to be able to, to see uh, what each other are building. So does everyone want to, does everyone want to, to go and claim a room? If any, everyone goes and uh, picks whatever room that they, uh, they, they want to, to build in. And they can go and get stuff. Started. So let me explain what my idea is because as I said it is a oh, <laughs> You missed you missed fizzy. I already went through the doorway. You were too slow <laughs> So yeah, this is what my idea is So I was trying to come up with an idea for ages and I just couldn't think of anything I had a complete mental block and I kept thinking about the fact that I had a mental block and I was like You know what? This is Minecraft and everything's blocked. So my head's a block. So I was just kind of thinking about mental blocks and Minecraft. And I thought, you know what would be funny is to do an exhibit about the fact I couldn't think what the exhibit would be. So I'm going to do an exhibit called Mental Block. And all it's going to be is one single block. So all it's going to be is one dirt block down on the floor in the very middle of the room. And there we go. This block represents my mental block and the fact I couldn't think of anything. So it is a block and it's just a bit of dirt. So it's a bit boring kind of representing the fact that I couldn't think of anything interesting. So here we go. This is my art exhibit. It's really a made to make people think to use their own mental block <laughs> and have a think about it. So all I need to, to do 
is going to add a, a sign on the, the front here, uh, which just says the, the name of the, the exhibit and uh, who did it, and everyone else is uh, going to, to do the same. And then that's me done. The thing is, though, is that I know that everyone else won't be finished with their exhibits yet. So what I've decided uh, to do for the, the episode while everyone's working hard and uh, building what they, they need to build is I am just going to go to the, the fun land and I'm just going to go and play games. So <laughs> that's what the, the plan for today is. You thought I was going to be building, but I'm not. Well, I can't kind of did build. I placed a block, but here we go. That is my exhibit, Mental Block by Stampy. So Benji, uh, do you want to come and, uh, and join me? And we're going to head to the, the fun land. See you later, everyone. Have fun building. <laughs> I'll be back a little bit later on uh, to, to check out what it is that they've built. Uh, but yeah, I just thought I'd go and head to the, the fun land. And let me show you over here as well, because I kind of I kind of showed you a little bit uh, over in this direction a while ago, but I've not kind of showed you properly, because remember, this all used to be ocean. You remember there's the, um, the, the cave where hit the target had a base. is like down under here that was an island and then all of this land here this was all built by hand by me to cover this entire area and the reason for this is so i can start building some brand new mini games over here so uh, underneath the, uh, the the ground here uh, there's just loads and loads and loads of water uh, that i've kind of just completely covered up uh, just to make even more room for even more mini games but seeing as i'm here in the fun land all by myself well i got bungee uh bungee uh, i got benji uh, joining me as well i need to play a game which i can play by myself and I think the perfect uh, game for for me to play is the uh, the the fashion sense mini game so if you don't know what this one is it's basically a memory game and let me uh, demonstrate it by playing it so What's going to happen is I'm going to press this button here. These armor stands are going to be completely filled up with a uh, different color armor. I need to remember exactly what the, the armor is. And then I need to rebuild it on these armor stands, open the doors and see if it matches. So what I need to do is I need to go and shut over these doors so I can't see what they're going to be. And then this is going to be the, the top one. And then that's going to, to be the, the bottom one here. So right then, let's give this a go. I'm, I'm pretty bad at this game. I will be honest, but I'm going to try my very best <laughs> and see how well I can do. Let's see if I can try and get at least four points because then that uh, is one single armor stand. They will be sliding past any second and oh, okay. I think I might be able to get this one because this bottom one, this was all like brown and orange, wasn't it? I think it was... Oh, which way, which, 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 which way was the brown and which way was the orange? <laughs> I think it was orange on top and then brown on the bottom. It might be completely reversed though, but... Uh, oh, I did this wrong actually. This is meant to be... Uh, yeah, that's orange then. I'm meant to, to get some, some brown boots, I think, maybe? Um... Let's grab, yeah, let's, let's grab some brown boots like this and let's put them down there. And then what was the, what was the chest plate? Let, let's just put a brown chest plate down as well. Right, that's what I'm going for for the bottom one. It was something like that. And you know what? I've completely forgotten what the top one was. I have literally, I might as well guess. I might as well have a bit of a guess, but I honestly have no <laughs> idea what it was. I think there was brown on the top one as well. Then was there like a, um... A white hat, and oh, I'm, we I'm wearing, I'm wearing the, the brown armor here as well. I didn't mean to, <laughs> I didn't mean to, to put that on. And then I think there might have been a white helmet, I think. And then I have no idea for the trousers. Let's just go for light blue trousers and boots. I don't know if that's right, but I have to, to guess something. Right, let's see if I can get my target of four points. I'm pretty sure I won't. So now I can go and open the, the doors and it can be uh, revealed. And oh, that was great. I didn't even see the green boots. So how did I do? Oh, so the brown chest plate, that was right. The hat was wrong. And oh no, it was. It was, um, it was orange trousers. So that's one point on that side. And then... The other side was completely wrong. I got, I got, I got a little bit of white, but it was iron. Uh, but yeah, that was very good. So I got one point <laughs> after all of that. I got one point. So tell you what, let's have another go and let's see if I can get a better score than one point. <laughs> it's actually not that. Um, it's not that bad playing it by yourself. I don't know these. These items need to, to go in this chest here. Uh, so, um, actually, no, I don't. I can just put them away in here because it doesn't really matter too much. So, yeah, I can put them away in there. Uh, I can then go and um, uh, put these away in there as well. It's been a little while since uh, I've played this game. There's so many games that I've only played once. Like, I spent so long planning and building all of these mini games, and there's so many of them that I've literally only played once. This is going to be a, a great opportunity uh, for, for me to, to go and uh, play a bunch of them again. So, I think that if I have one more game of this, 
this, then hopefully that'll be enough time uh, for everyone to, to finish off their uh, art exhibits, because it's not very big. Like, their rooms aren't very big, so I'm sure that uh, they shouldn't be uh, able to, well, they shouldn't take too long uh, to, to get completely done. And then maybe if we have time, uh, we can bring everyone else over here as well, and then we can have a, a game on one of the, the other mini games. Should be good fun. But for now, uh, let's see if I can beat my score of one. Surely I can't get worse than one. <laughs> Let's see, though. Right, we've uh, pressed the, the button. Uh, there's going to be a whole load uh, of random armor fired uh, onto them now. And uh, let's see. Uh, how well we can uh, how well we can do you only have a, a very split second to, to see it so purple red orange green so on the top there was there was um red and uh, and purple on the the top here I, I think i remember that then i said or, or orange and orange and green on this i think it was a um green uh, was it like an orange hat or something uh, i think it might have been a green hat then was it like an orange? I think it might have been an orange chest plate. I don't think I have an orange chest plate. Let's just, just pretend that this is an orange chest plate. And let's put that down there. And then for everything else, I have literally no idea. I've already forgot. It's so difficult. It flashes past so fast. It's so difficult to remember. Let's let's just put anything down below, though. Let's just put diamond and... Um, what's a different color? Pink, I guess? Just for a random guess. If that ends up being right, then that's going to be amazing. I'm pretty sure it won't be. And let's just put white and, uh, and black on the other side over here. Right. Let's... Let's see if I can get at least two points. I'm not even sure if I've beaten my score of one. <laughs> Let's go and see the, the 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 result then. So the top side. Oh, there we go. I got two right on the, the top side. The bottom's completely wrong, but the hat and chest plate are right. Then let's see this side. Oh, no. It's completely wrong. It should be an orange hat, green chest plate. I got them the wrong way around. And then purple and green. But there we go. I was able to get two points. A rubbish score, but I was still able to, to double the first score that I got. So I guess it's better than nothing. <laughs> Right then, let's uh, let's go back to the, the, the art gallery then, and uh, let's see how well everyone's been doing. I know I got mine done way before everyone else, but then again, I was pretty much only placing down a, uh, a single block, so <laughs> it was probably quite easy for, for me to, to, to do it. So the good thing about art and like modern art, is it doesn't really matter so much about what you create. It's more just about the the idea, I guess. You know, because some modern art, uh, modern art I like, some I don't like, but it's more about kind of what what the thinking and the message behind the art is rather than what it is. So even though it is just a, a, a dirt block, I think that it's a pretty amazing exhibit. But you know what? I reckon that everyone else's is probably going to be better than mine. And I can't wait to, to see what everyone else uh, has done. And oh, I can hear, I can hear noises. Can you hear that? Someone's built a, a noisy art exhibit by the, the sound of it. Oh, I can hear I can hear pistons going and note blocks and all sorts. What's happened? It's turned into a circus. And oh, here is Fizzy Elephant ready to stand in the, the doorway. I'd expect nothing else from now on, Fizzy. <laughs> right, have you have you finished your, your art exhibit? Is it is it ready to, to be displayed? Uh, I guess it should be if you're you're out here. All uh, right, do you want to, uh, to to take me inside and show me? And oh, the, the sign's not... The sign's not showing up for, for me for some reason. It's not uh, showing me the, the name of it. Uh, that's uh, a little bit odd. It looks like some of the, the signs are, are working, uh, but these ones aren't. So uh, do you want to come and show me inside anyway? And, oh, okay. It looks like there's a, a minecart spinning around, and it's playing some pretty awesome music. I'm not surprised you've basically built a roller co coaster. That really doesn't surprise me, Fizzy. <laughs> well, tell you what. I'm going to go and look at everyone else's. While I do that, do you want to write down the, the sign again? Uh, just to, to explain what the what it is <laughs> and what the, the meaning behind it is uh, because for some reason the the sign has shown up blank for for me anyway it looks like uh looks like Polly's uh, is working now uh, William do you want to go and do your sign uh, as well because uh, that one's blank for for me for for some reason and oh, actually I've realized we need to, to write the signs reversed underneath as well for the the reflection we'll worry about that later anyway Polly uh, what is it that you've built passing time by Polly right let's go into have a, a little look inside then at all Redstone, lots and lots of redstone. I'm not surprised, Polly. So it's called passing time. And oh look! Oh look, it's pushing the it's pushing the sand block around. I guess the sand block is supposed to be time. I guess kind of like a, a sand timer or something. And it's literally passing time back and forth. I love how literal it is. That's really cool. And this redstone's crazy as well. I don't know how you managed to fit all of this in in such a, a tiny space. <laughs> this is really cool. I love it, Polly. And it definitely uh, represents you. This is a really cool art, art exhibit. All right then, while everyone else is writing down their their signs. Oh, looks like Williams is ready actually. This is the this is the the frozen 
frozen fountain. Right, let's go and have a little bit of a look inside. And oh, it literally is a frozen fountain. Oh, this is cool. It's like a it's like a normal fountain with all the, the water squirting out of the, the top, but it's all just been frozen in ice. It kind of reminds me of the uh, the lobby back here with all of the, the floor made out of ice. This is really cool. It's kind of a little a little bit hypnotic just to, to stare at it all frozen like that. I like it. Nice job, William. Nice job. I didn't know what I was going to expect from you, to be fair, William. And I really didn't expect this, but this is a this is really awesome. So let's go and have a little look at the um the, the Lunar Friends exhibit, because we didn't get a, a chance to see that earlier. And it's called Home. I wonder what they I wonder what they think of when they think of home. So I guess this is supposed to be my Lunar Friends here, and then Oh look, I think they like I think this is supposed to be space. So this is the moon, and then these are all of the, the stars. And I guess this is probably supposed to be my lovely world. I think they're saying that they think of my lovely world and the moon as their home. Oh, that's good, because I wasn't sure how welcome they feel here and how settled they are. But if they think that the lovely world is kind of half of their home, then that's really good. Oh, that's really nice. Oh, I wish they were here to, uh, yeah, for me to, to say how cool that was. But I'll definitely uh, speak to them a little bit later on. And oh, <laughs> Fizzy standing in my doorway as expected. And what was the, the name of his exhibit? The ostentatious carcophony. Oh, very fancy, Fizzy. Very fancy. <laughs> I guess that's uh, that's what all of the, the the music is. Then this is the uh, the 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 Minecraft red uh, the Minecraft redstone car company. And can I ride this thing, by the way? Oh no! Oh, I think I broke it, Fizzy. I think I broke. It. I think I made it go the wrong way. There we go. It's working again now. <laughs> right then. So this is uh this has been everyone's art exhibit. You can have a look at mine if you want. It kind of looks um. It's a little bit rubbish compared to all of yours, to be honest. It, it's basically just a dirt block. I mean, I tried to, to big it up and make it fancier than it was. It's basically just a dirt block in the room. I think Fizzy likes it. You can see everyone really staring at it and trying to, to take it in and analyze everything that it means. <laughs> no flash photography, though, please, everyone. No pictures of the, the dirt block. Anyway, how about we leave this art museum and we go play some mini games, yeah? <laughs> Does that sound like fun? Right, everyone follow me. Everybody follow me. I know the perfect mini game that we should play after spending an episode building up. We had a, uh, a nice afternoon thinking about very high level things and thinking about the psychology of, you know, life and kind of all of the, the meaning and philosophy about, you know, what it means to be inside of Minecraft. And I think the best thing to do after that is to jump on some giant vegetables and hit each other with food. We're basically going to have a food fight now. <laughs> From very high class to, to a food fight. So right, this is Broth Brawl. Everyone needs to, to grab whatever food they, they want uh, from the, the chest here. If you've brought your, your own food, that's fine. I'm going to I'm gonna use a potato, I think, and uh, might maybe use a mushroom as well. So let's go and grab that. And then we all need to, to go and climb up the, the ladder and uh, stand on the, the outside. I'm going to go three, two, one. We're all going to jump in, and we just basically need to, to punch each other into the, the water. Last person standing wins. So we begin in three... Two, one, go, go, go. Everyone jump onto the, the vegetables and we need to try and knock each other in. Whoa, William's gone straight for me. And oh no, I think we knocked each other down. <laughs> me and William just knocked each other straight into the uh, into the, the soup, I guess. And oh, Polly slipped. Polly slipped on the pea <laughs> and fell in the water. Oh, I, I mean, I mean the vegetable, uh, the vegetable pea. <laughs> right then, let's uh, all drop down. And we can go and climb up the, the, the ladder and uh, we can go and have ourselves another game. Let's say first person to, to win three rounds is going to, to be the, the winner. So I've got to try and keep track of the, the rounds now. So Fizzy, Fizzy won that one. So that's one point to, to Fizzy and uh, Fizzy is now in the, the lead. So after three, we're all going to jump down and we'll have another go. So we'll begin in three two, one, go, 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 go. I've got to be very careful dropping in. Sometimes you can just drop straight in and fall out. Right, I'm staying. Oh, no. <laughs> I fell straight in. I was thinking I'm going to stay away from William. And oh, I think Polly's won. Right, Polly was able to, to win that round. So that's one point to, to Polly uh, as well. And uh, one point to, to Fizzy. And no point so far to, to William or me. Yeah, I was going to say I'm going to stay away from William because he knocked me in last time. Then I went to, to back off and just fell straight in and didn't <laughs> do very well at all. But right then, all right, let's go and, uh, and climb up. And we can have another go. And we can begin in three, two, one. Go, 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 go. All right, I'm going to try and jump onto one of the, the bigger vegetables. And oh, William fell straight into the, the water. You, you need to grab some food, Polly. You need to hit them with the, the food. It literally makes no difference, but that's the way we play the game. And oh, I think Fizzy has fallen in as well. Right, it's a 1v1 with uh, with me and Polly. Can I get it? Oh, she's on a pee. This is a good time to get her. And yes, I was able to, to drop her in. And that is going to, to be a point for uh, a point for, for me. So uh, that's going to be uh, one point to, to me, uh, Fizzy and Polly. And, uh, and none yet for.
for, for William, uh, but there's still plenty of time left. So as I said, the first person to, to win three rounds uh, is going to, yeah, be able to, to win this minigame. Isn't this good? We had building, we had fashion sense, and now we're having broth brew all in one episode. Right, I think I'm going to use the, uh, I think I'm going to use the, the mushroom this round. So we're going to go and jump back in in three, two, one, go, go, go. Right, let's go and jump on the, the big bro uh, broccoli. Let's go to the carrot. Oh, can I get Polly in? And there we go. Polly fell in. Oh, but no. Fizzy snuck up on me. It's now between Fizzy and William. And whoa, that was a great hit there by William. And that is, is his uh, first point on the board. We have now all won one round each. So this could literally go any way now. Let's uh let's maybe try and change my uh, my food out. Let's go and um let's grab a, a red mushroom and maybe, maybe a fish as well. I think I'm going to save the fish for the final round because that's the that's the the most powerful food to use. But for now, <laughs> let's go and use the uh, the the red mushroom. Let's all go and uh, uh, shuffle around a little bit, and uh, we can jump back in in three. Two, one, go, go, go. Let's go and land on this giant eggplant. And where's everyone going? Let's try, let's try and be very careful now. I don't, oh. <laughs> I fell straight in. I didn't realize that I was so close to the edge. I was trying to be careful and stay back. And I just walked backwards off it. But there we go. That's Polly and Fizzy left now. They're going after each other. And that's Fizzy was the winner of that round and is now in the lead. And actually only needs to win one more round to be the total winner. I think it's time to bring out the fish. I need to, to make sure that fizzy doesn't win and we all have a chance of winning so i'm gonna go and bring up the the fish uh, the fish and see how well i can do so let's all go and uh, spread out uh, around the, the the giant pot and uh, we can begin again in three two one go 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 let's all go and, uh, and jump down and uh, let's see how well i can survive i want to be careful of fizzy and oh william's gone straight in already fizzy's close oh <laughs> we're just out of range oh that was a good hit with the fish he was just about able to, to stay on and oh he's jumped over he's jumped over and oh he knocked me off fizzy's so good at this game oh no but he fell in at the same time i think we both knocked each other down so now polly and fizzy both have two points and William and me only have one point each. So uh, yeah, if uh, William and uh, and me win, we're both going to have a chance. If not, it uh, looks like uh, Polly or Fizzy could win. Let's uh, let's use the bread this round. Actually, no, let's use my sword. Let's use my, my diamond enchanted sword this round. I think that's going to be effective. Only joking. <laughs> I'm going to go and use the, the, the loaf of bread. Right then, let's have the, the, the next round beginning in three two, one, and go, go, go. Right, I want to be really careful. Let's stay on the, the potato and let's wait for, for people to, to come to me. Then I can go and try and knock them off unless I see an opening. And look how careful everyone's been. Everyone's really staying back. No, everyone's running in. Everyone's running in. Oh, it looks like it's just me and William next. Can I go and try and get him? I want to try and get him when he's on one of the, the, the smaller vegetables. If I stay on this celery, if I get knocked back, I should be okay. Oh, no, I fell in. Oh, I think William fell in at the, the same time. <laughs> Did you fall in at the exact same time as me? Right, I guess that one's going to, to be a, a draw then. So we both get one point because we both drew in first place. And what that means is that Fizzy's got two points. I have two points. William has two points and Polly has two points, which means no matter what, this is the, the final round. Whoever wins this round is going to, to be the champion. I am definitely going to be using the, the fish this time. <laughs> right then, we can all jump in in three, two, one, and go, go, go. Right, this time I'm not going to be a coward. I'm just going to go and try and charge in and see if I can take some people down. And there we go. Oh no, Polly didn't fall off. Oh, can I get her? I was able to, to sneak around behind her. There we go. I was able to, to knock Polly in. William's going against Fizzy and oh, Fizzy was able to win. Right, it's between Fizzy and me. Can I get revenge for him blocking me in every single doorway all episode? We are going to, to see it out. <laughs> I need to stop doing that. That was the most anticlimactic end to the game ever. But Fizzy, you are the, the winner. I was going to knock you in anyway there. <laughs> Well done, Fizzy. You won the game of Broth Brawl in a rather embarrassing fashion for me. <laughs> right then, though, that is the, the end of this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing everyone's uh, art over in the, the, the Smart Art exhibit. And oh, there's a creeper over here. Let's go and take him out. And yeah, hopefully you enjoyed seeing all of the uh, the, the old mini games being replayed as well. But that is uh, the end of this episode here. In the next episode, we are going to be coming back to the fun land. But this time we're going to be building a brand new video, uh, a brand new mini game, sorry. And there's going to be a link in the description to that video once it is online. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching and we will see you all later. Bye!